Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is our very popular Cuisinart Air Fryer Convection Toaster Oven. Today what I'm going to do is give you a couple of tips and tricks on how to keep your oven fully operational and well maintained. So, the first thing I want to mention is, you know the exterior is made out of stainless steel. Never use anything abrasive on it. Always use a soft cloth. I usually like to use a microfiber cloth. Use um, mild soapy water. What you can do is just, I'm just dipping it in this today so um, it's easy to get a little on the counter clean. So you just want to use some mild soapy water and clean the exterior by rubbing it. The other thing is always do this when your machine is unplugged, like so. And also um, make sure it's cool. So after you wipe it down with um, the mild um, soapy water, I just suggest that you buff it so that it's dry, like so. And you can do the same thing with the front of the oven. So there we have that. And like I said, never use anything um, abrasive on the oven because you will actually mar the finish. So in the front here we have our door. You can do the same with the, um, the window. If you cook a lot of greasy foods, it's really important to keep the oven clean because it'll work um, the best possible that way. So just same thing, buff it clean. Um, in the front also you'll notice that this is the crumb tray. Always use the oven with the crumb tray in place. That's really important because it, it will actually collect any crumbs or drips from any of the food that you're cooking. So the same thing. Wipe it with um, mild soapy water. Dry it. Always put it back in place. And the reason is you'll notice when you open the oven and the crumb tray is out, this is actually the very bottom of the oven. So it's important to keep this in place. So the other things that come with your oven are your basket, your tray, and that's what you're going to use to air fry. And then also your rack, which is adjustable. So you can put it on the first level or the second level. Another thing you should note too is it has numbers here one and two in the in the recipe book it'll tell you which rack to use for what functionality so the thing you should do is when you use the um, air fryer if you're doing anything that's um, a little bit greasy that you get some drips always soak this in hot sudsy water something that I like to do is I have one of those brushes um, nylon brushes and I actually use soap and water and I scrub this with the nylon brushes to get any food particles out. Never put this in the dishwasher because it's not dishwasher safe. And the same thing with the tray. Soak it because um, if you don't keep it clean you will get some grease buildup on that. Now for the interior of your oven you're going to do exactly the same thing. Um, and this is really important. Um, never use any uh, abrasives again on the inside of the oven. The most important thing is to keep the walls clean for any grease spills or grease build up after you use it. Um, and then also the top of the oven, the very top where the fan is, you're gonna wanna keep that very clean also because it'll help in um, really good um, air circulation. And the other thing that it's good for is um, it'll make sure that you're toasting really evenly um, and consistently as well as um, baking and air frying. So you're just gonna dry that, same thing. Wipe the gasket here in the front. Don't forget that because sometimes you'll get some uh, some uh, spills on that and some residue. So make sure you keep that clean. And I have to tell you, I use my air fryer every day. I literally put almost anything that I cook in it. I love it because it's just me and my husband. But you can cook a lot of food in here. It holds three pounds of food. I like to do, let's say. Uh, a protein and vegetables and potatoes and you can make a whole meal in one so there you have it that's how simple and easy it is to maintain your Cuisinart air fryer convection toaster oven